Hello, I'm finally getting around to reviewing the turquoise house that I rented in Scottsdale, Arizona. Here is the main living area when you walk in and out those plantation shutters. Um, you can see the pool area. There's a large dining room table connected to the open and remodeled kitchen. Everything we needed was there. The great thing about uh, this kitchen is they had children's items as well. Now this is the other living area, so you have two at this house. Out the sliding doors is a perfect backyard. It's really flat. That grass over there is um, fake grass, which we love. We had that when we lived in Arizona before. It's very, very clean, well manicured outside. The kids had lots of fun on the putting green there. There's also a dining room area outside as well. And then the big, big bonus for me having little kids is that the pool is gated. If you have small children, you know you can be very scared. What if, you know, they run away for 30 seconds and um, an ac accident can happen. So I loved this, it was great. Um, when we went, it was January and we did not use the pool. However, we plan on going back and um, using the pool when it's a little bit warmer. So this area was great. They also have lots of um, fruit trees that they encourage you to pick from. Um, grapefruit, I think most of it was grapefruit, maybe some orange as well. Um, tons, ripe and delicious. So there's extra seating there you can see. Now this is going into the bedrooms. All the bedrooms have plantation shutters, which I love because I like it to be dark when I sleep. This is the main guest bathroom, completely remodeled. And this Airbnb is the cleanest Airbnb I've ever seen. It was just spick and span. Here we have another guest bedroom. Every bedroom um, has a TV, has um, nice linens, as you can tell, very clean. They have closets and dressers to store your items. Now we are going back into the kitchen. As I mentioned, completely remodeled. They had kids cups, plates, utensils. If you travel with small kids, you know that is a huge bonus because you don't want to haul that stuff with you. Um, there's a washer and dryer as well. So we did laundry during our stay. And then out here in the garage, extra stuff. And it's pet friendly. I did not smell any pet smells, but there's a kennel there that you can use and a dog bed. So that's great. Um, all in all, this is the best Airbnb that I've ever stayed at. It's conveniently located in Paradise Valley, which is part of Scottsdale. It's about five minutes away from the Paradise Valley Mall. It's very close to restaurant shopping. Kierlin is a big um, shopping center. There's a golf course there as well. It's very close to that. So this location to me is perfect. The road was very quiet. We didn't hear any noise. Directly next door, the owners have another house that looks just as beautiful as this one. So you can rent both or one and they're very reasonable. Um, I booked through Airbnb. They also have their own website, which obviously would be less expensive. So I'll link that. Um, trying to think of what else I can tell you about the house. Uh, Check-in was easy. I also had groceries delivered from Safeway. So they were sitting on the doorstep when I arrived very safe neighborhood. The owner was so responsive, was not intrusive, but definitely checked in everything. Okay. Anything you need. That was really nice. And, um, yeah, so far this has been the best Airbnb that I've ever stayed at. I've stayed at Airbnbs all over the world and this is top on the list so far. So I just wanted to share it. It's great. If you have a family, if you don't have a family, it's still great. It's just the perfect layout. Um, I'm really hard pressed to think of anything that was wrong with it. I really can't think of anything. 
if you were to really force me to think of one thing, and this is being very, very picky, is a foam pillow would be great. <laughs> but that's what I say about every place um, I travel because I use Tempur-Pedic pillows. So that's super high maintenance, really. It couldn't get much better than this place. So I hope you liked this review. Um, the next one I will do is on the Weston Scottsdale. Uh, we stayed at there after we stayed at this house. So thanks for listening. Bye.